Hey guys, my name is Zabo, and today we are checking out um, Wanho's Blue Letter album. This is actually a um, um, Wanho was an artist that I was like, because I was looking for people to check out that I haven't checked out in a while. He was one of them that it's been a, a little bit since we checked out his last album. And, you know, I was like, yeah, I enjoy his albums. I enjoy his music. I enjoy, you know, each of the performances that he offers for us. So it's like, let's check it out. So let's continue on our journey with one ho. So if you guys are excited, make sure to like the video, comment down below any of your favorite songs from this album, Blue Letter. Um, subscribe, hit the bell so you'll be notified when my videos go live. And for any extra content, check out the Patreon down below. Um, if I sound a little bit different, just know that I am sick, but I'm trying to get through it, trying to record trying to record these um videos and get through it with the energy I try to provide. Like all day I've been trying to record all the videos I'm trying to get through. But it's like it's so hard. Like I get through one and then I try to and then I get through another one and then I need to take a break. Like I have to legit take a break because I'm like like I'm like, oh my God. Like I start to feel a little bit like lightheaded. But but then we'll stop my passion. I look like some damn Star Wars character right now. That's that's what I'd look like. Like a sick Star Wars character. Um But without further ado, the songs we're checking out are the intro, seasons and pattern. Uh oh yeah, patterns. I was like did I, did I see it wrong. But um yeah. Um and then we have blue, which we checked out when I did my Discover of one huh? Um live performance marine look version. And then we have no text, no call live band. Uh, band live concert um yeah we got that but i'm just letting you know if 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 you just see my um if you just see my like comments about it well at least i tried to get it on youtube and then we have come over tonight dance practice and then the rest are color code lyrics for 24 7 stranger and then we have the english version of blue so um without wasting any more time Let's get into it. I'm just gonna let the intro rock. <coughs> Oop. Did I pause it? I must have paused it. <laughs> Ugh. Dying, dying, dying. <laughs> This intro makes me feel like I'm actually on the water. I like that. I really enjoyed that intro because it made me feel like I was on the water. It just made me feel very calm and just very, um, I guess, reflective. Like I was really reflecting on that little moment. So I really like that. Yeah. Moving on to Blue Live Performance Marine Look version. So here we go. <coughs> 
It's actually been a while since I heard this song, so this will be like a reminder of what this song sounds like. Is this like a resort somewhere? Yeah. The feel part is reminding me. Look how much fun they're having with the performance. And in these outfits as well with the dancers too. here for you i really just i really i forgot about the vibe of this song it's just such a fun cool like like when did this come out like in terms of just september okay i don't know if this like came out like afterwards or but it, it does have like that very like kind of summer feel maybe like towards the end of summer but it just feels just feels nice it just has like it makes you feel you know, like playing in the water, playing in the sea, just having a good time on the beach. Like that's what I'm getting from. I, I really enjoy it, especially um with the way the dancers are too, with the facial expressions they're giving and his, his just vocals. Like, imagine this. Like, I don't even know how tall, but this buff, handsome dude sings with this beautiful voice, looking at you like this. Like, you are passing out. Like, so good. Let's continue. Can you feel Korea just looks so fun too. For some parts as well. <laughs> I like that. I can't wait to hear like what the English version of the song sounds like. That should be fun. Oh wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait one up. Um, gotta let it load up a little bit, but um, yeah, I really like that song. Just love the choreo, love the facial expression. I I literally forgot about that song, but now I remember definitely now that I have the whole album, like you know, to play through. I definitely won't forget about this song again. 
Um, uh, but moving on to the next one, just called no text, no call. So, um, yeah, here we go. No calls from you. I got no text, got no calls. No text, no calls from you. I got no text, got no No text, no calls. Hey, you there? I thought that was like the background reflecting off his hair, <laughs> but it's actually his hair dyed a little bit, like the tips or parts of it. Can't talk to me. I hate that things have changed and we love no more. No, we used to. pause it here but um yeah i really like his voice in this song i really like the song too it's like basically it's like you broken up with this person who you thought you'd be you know forever with and now you wake up alone in the bed probably missing them and you maybe call or text them but they you know they don't text or call you back and it's like maybe you broke their heart or maybe you couldn't fix it anymore i don't know but all I know is I really like his vo his vocals. I really like, you know, the live, too. Like, you get to really hear it um, raw and just sounds sounds good live as he does with the recording. So, crazy. Like, I, like, 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 do you see what I mean? Like, you can just see the buffness through this shirt. And he's wearing a loose shirt, too, by the way. And you can still see it. <laughs> like... I like how you didn't even have to show, like, abs in that live performance. And you could already still be like, dang. If he would have showed something here, it would have been crazy. Because he's done it before. Like, he's done it multiple times. And I bet you people go crazy. I bet you. Because it's just easy. And he works for this, too. Like, I, was, I need just it, like, it inspires me to want to just work out. But it's like, I don't know where to start, where to do, what to, like, like how? Like I don't really know how to start it, but let's continue. There's no calls from you. You, you. No text, no calls. I got no text, can no text. I got no text, can no calls. Hate this. Yes, go up there. No text, no calls from you. 
don't you don't stare at me like that. Do not stop. <laughs> Still has that silly, silly personality as always, and I love it. Has not changed a bit. <laughs> Woo! And with the live band too, like such a great song. I can't wait to hear I like this. I guess the studio version sounds. I bet y'all like this more than the studio version of it. Be like, man, the live band killed it. Can't be better than that. <laughs> oh, my nose. Oh, so the white one, the white shirt that we saw was for blue. Okay. I mean, it makes sense. Like, you should do it. It's live for your title. But I didn't know you would do one for a B side, which was. It's a cool B-side. I liked it. I really liked it. I really liked the song a lot. Uh, but moving on to the next song, which is called Come Over Tonight, Dance Practice. The fixed version. Oh, what's her name? Honey J, right? The dancer, Honey J. I like this move a lot. They do. Okay. Oh yeah, this is the please come over tonight. The sexy song. here because I really like I really like the spin that he did because of how separated each of his body parts were like the lower upper and even like his head I think was like it, it like it looked like it all turned out like different intervals like it, it looked so weird but it's like cool like in a good way like oh wow like whoa <laughs> what happened to his body like it's like it like he was a robot but I liked it because I know it wasn't like that. But it it looked it looked so, um, so crazy at like different intervals of turning that it made it look like that. So I really liked that. I really liked the song. I mean, basically it's the sexy come over tonight, baby. Like, let's do it. <laughs> we we all know. I don't need to explain it. I like the song. Like his voice. Like the um intensity and just like love the like kind of like <laughs> you know come over, baby kind of look that he's given and like the appeal that he's doing with the body the clothes he's using his clothes like everything like like the choreo a lot so let's continue <laughs> Mm. 
Yeah, that. I don't know why that looks so weird, but in like a good way. I like it a lot. <laughs> Look how he's smiling. Look how he's doing like a goofy smile in such a sexy song. Like, man, I, lo I love him. I love him. I know I wasn't a part of like Monster X at the beginning. I mean, at least I am checking them out from the beginning. Unlike some people, I feel like. I feel like they check out the new stuff and then check out the older stuff on their own time. But at least I'm reacting from the beginning, from the very start to try to catch up to the most more recent stuff whenever I can. But it's just like I feel I feel for you guys to not have the complete group, but I f I feel like, you know, with the recent song that he released, it's like he doesn't regret it and he doesn't want um he never wants to regret it. And like basically never even if he was given a second chance, he said he was have everything happen the same way. Because it's like, it, it makes sense, like, you know, a lot of things happen, you know, we learn later on about things or um, about stuff, and it's like, man, I wish they would have stayed together or this or that, but it's like, well, if they, since, you know, when stuff happens and an artist leaves or an artist has to go or an artist becomes this or that, but they make such great music maybe by themselves and stuff, it's like, do they throw, do they wish to throw all that away? and stay and maybe never have seen that or maybe never came up with that idea and all that like you just never know what stuff would have happened if none of this would have happened so it's like it's almost like everything was made and was planned out like this even though it might be sad or hard to like swallow sometimes if you let it happen and you you know tried your best to do whatever you could and it happened but this is the result and People are still loving it, enjoying it, and everything. Like, you know, things I feel like happen for a reason. And, you know, I don't think we would have gotten all this great Wanho music until, like, maybe later on in his life. And we might not even gotten this type of music either. So, you know, things happen for a reason. I'm not saying that I wish it would have happened. But I'm, what I'm saying is it happened. But I'm just happy to see that he's still doing his thing still living his dream and you know being happy so i really like this really like his songs from this album so far but moving on for to the next um song which is 24 7 i just like that he still has that goofiness <laughs> like he just starts smiling at the end of that sexy song like Let's stay forever, yeah. 
I feel like this song is short. I'm here oh, for you 24 7. I can't even think of it. I need to 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 think of it. I'm gonna pause it here, but yeah, really like the song. Feels like it's just a very turn up song, but also like, you know, you know, a song for, you know, youth to listen to, to just turn up and have fun. Basically saying, I'll be here for you 24-7 no matter what. I'm here for you. I love you, and I'll stay forever young. Let's never lose our youth. Let's grow up always being young, basically forever. And I love that. I really like it. Let's continue. Let's continue. That's all. Look, that's all we have to say about this song. There's nothing else for you. Because there's really not much going on with the lyrics. It's just like a verse, and then this part, and then little verse, and that's it. But I like it, though. <coughs> yeah, I like that. Really, I really enjoyed this. Oh God, Cupid! <laughs> I love Cupid. I'm sorry for looking at that, but like Cupid, man, I'm glad to see Fifty Fifty song just you know be all on my for you page and everything. Such a nice look to see. Uh, but moving on to the next song, which is called Stranger. So here we go. I like how pixelated this picture is. I don't know. It makes it, it gives it like an old school like vibe. It might just be the quality of my thing too with this name. Sometimes I feel like a stranger. Sometimes I feel like a stranger.
was going to pause it, but I guess that was the end of the song, but, yeah, I, I really like the feeling of this song, like, I really like the picture, because it, like, matches the song, like, you know, sometimes I feel like a stranger being all along, like, sometimes I feel like I don't, like, you know, a stranger, you don't mess with strangers, you don't know anything about them. you don't know anything about that person, it was just a person that you don't have any info about, just, you know, a person that exists, and sometimes... I feel like that, like, I'm a person that just exists with kind of, like, no info about me, no nothing. Like, I feel like no one cares enough about me to want to know about me. That's that's how I feel, like, like I'm, like, a stranger. Like, I, like I know I'm a stranger to you guys. Yeah, it makes sense, but I feel as if I am a stranger in, in general, like, the world doesn't want to know about me. Like, I'm alone and stuff. It's like a song, like, kind of like, don't make sure to not leave me. I don't want to be alone, basically. So, excuse me. Um, I like the song, though. I really do. Very, like, I like that he goes from very, like, upbeat, exciting songs to very, um, like, um, like, emotional, sentimental songs. Let me fix the camera. Okay. Well, moving on to the last song, which is Blue English Version. So, yeah, I'm excited to see. I mean, I'm just excited to see and hear how the English version sounds. Because it might be different or it just might be the same. Just I can sing along to the song better. But here we go. This is, we already heard it. Let's just listen to it all the way through. Feels like a very like rap part, which it does. Like feels so quick. Feel 
Well, I could say the last bit of the lyrics weren't right. <laughs> but I mean, it was different anyway. So probably that's why they didn't bother to change it. But there you have it. That has been One Ho's Blue Letter album. I enjoyed it. I really liked it. The feeling of just how exciting the songs could be. And just, you know, the last song, Stranger, being very emotional, very sentimental shows, you know. That he could do both. Like, he could be very upbeat, positive. He could be sexy. But he can also be very, um, I guess, thought-provoking and very deep and very um, emotional and sentimental, too. And he showcased that throughout, you know, the whole album. Just, you know, just how fun, you know, his music can be as well. I really like his vocals, as always. Um, but, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed my reaction. Sorry for... I guess the sick reaction, you know, that's what I'm going to call it. Um, it's like a, it's like a whole different energy and just a whole different like vibe, I guess you could say, but sorry that I'm sick, I guess. I'm, I'm sorry. Uh, I guess I, I shouldn't be sorry, but I, I feel bad, but, uh, hopefully you guys, um, still enjoyed this reaction and I'll see you guys for the next video. Bye.